did you put the tractor out? Oh, YouTubers, yeah, put the tractor out. We have another mod done. Hint, hint. <laughs> clue, clue, right there. Clue, clue, right there. Man, what a mess I had here yesterday. Again, yeah, yes. I'll post a picture right there. I even made you a little bracelet. You did. I'll put a picture there. <laughs> <laughs> Another Christmas gift. Well, no one has one like it. No one has one like that. I guarantee you that. Oh. Hey, what's missing? Uh, oh, the iron worker's iron missing. Iron worker's gone. Bye. <laughs> I the door. You, you wouldn't be able to pry that from your No, my dead, dead hands. hands. No, no. I want to be buried with it. I think so. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, we've had uh, we, we've done another mod on the B series in the 2650. Well, you know what? Uh, you said you have a lot of people calling in. They're looking. They're giving you ideas and whatnot on different things. So, and you know some of the uh, some of the mods that we've already designed, people want them for their machine. That's right. And we just can't reach out and do them for all the machines because we're lucky to have this. I mean. Newfoundland Kubota Limited has left that here. That must be here now a month or more now. Oh, yeah. yeah, you know, and and uh, their their generosity through their generosity, generosity and their patience, we've been able to dabble at it because it's been dabbling because we've been doing yes other things right. Plus the expansion is still right. going on, although we're we're ninety five percent there. Uh, if we weren't having a storm coming. Thursday night, mm -hmm. we would have probably completed the expansion. So maybe we won't get the storm. But uh, that's besides the point. We'll be in it in another week for sure. Um, what else? Yeah, so, you know, the tractor is still here, so we did another mod. It's, uh, it's the type of mod that we're going to uh, build as the orders come in because we don't want to. The problem is with, with having too much stock in a small place, even with the expansion, you start to run out of room. Mm -hmm, that's <laughs> you right. Know? So, you know, we, uh, we, you know, like our turnover rate on anything is less than a week. That's right. You yeah. know, and I've worked sometimes through the night. That's right. Or halfway through the night anyway. I've worked all weekends to fulfill the orders and every piece is done Mm -hmm. is done as if it was the only piece so That's right. nothing is rushed um, I guess we'll take them out and we'll show them the uh, show them the new mod for the, oh yeah yeah well I think it's a you know it's a mod that's seen before they just have never seen it before on, on a cab uh, on a cab tractor yeah cab true yeah, yeah true. this is the first time this mod has been done which is going to be the, the saw saddle uh, it's the first time it's been done to a to a tractor with a cab now that's cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And uh, not only that, we used existing holes that were there by oh, the manufacturer. No, 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 drilling. So when you get it, there's two bolts. It's it's uh, literally a five or ten minute, the most. Ten minutes if you got to go look for a wrench. Five minutes if you have your wrench in your back pocket. And it's, uh, <laughs> right. it's not evasive. It looks like it's a part of the tractor. And, well, we think it's, uh, well, Sexy. I just... I think it's really nice on the tractor. Eh? Very nice. So let's go we'll have a look. Isn't that a beautiful looking tractor though? Beautiful. Yeah. The the uh, 2650 is not bad either. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you were complimenting Killer down there. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Yeah, Killer is probably being neglected, he's thinking. Here's what the saw mount looks now, like. Now that I'm telling you it's sexy. It looks good, don't you? It looks good. Oh, and oh. the beauty of it, if you want to remove your uh, your FEL, you can still remove it without even removing the saw. Oh, no, that's sweet. <laughs> you know, if you wanted to, but I would recommend removing the saw just in case something happened and you didn't remove something properly and you jeopardize the safety of your saw. And. Uh, there you and go. there it is, and it's very strong. It's it's wow. it's basically part of the tractor. There's gusset plates and everything, but it's uh, it's go. done really well. And of course, you know, it, it has these special levers that won't unwind. It's it can take a, a pretty big saw, you know. Oh, yeah. It's got a good cut in it. I, I uh, milled it all out. 
I'm going to tell you, we even, uh, well, we've seen people with bigger saws in there. Oh, well, sawmills, more than saws. So, you know, here it is, and, and this is how you tighten it up, right? If you don't like the orientation of the, the, the levers, you can pull them out and let them lock in whichever way you want, right? So I kind of I kind of like them like that, right? Because when you're going real fast with the tractor, the wind don't drag. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and when you're in the cab, you can still see your wheels. Oh yeah. There's a lot. Uh, there's a lot going on there. It's just a nice, cool design, right? Very. Let me see so, from this side. Yeah. Yeah, that is cool. Now, the other thing is with this too, is we've made this in such a way that if somebody said, well, I have a third function valve, or I have something already on that side, these two holes that are already in the FEL are in the same, same position over here. So we have to do a little bit of reverse engineering from what we have. There's a hole here, and there's one under the decal right here. Mm -hmm. So we could actually make one for what we call the driver's side. Sweet. So there, it's kind of transferable so if, if you want one just tell us what side you want it to be mounted on yeah. and we'll go ahead and we'll do it it's a uh, it's a really nice mod there's not a lot of people making mods for b-series tractors and we're we're really trying our best it's not the most lucrative thing in the world no. but it, we're trying our best to get a catalog put together so we can have different things you know because once we move away from the b we're going to be away from the b for a while so and it's a great time to pick up your hubby a Christmas gift. Okay. <laughs> hint, hint. Like, like these, these particular type of mods that we do, we consider them kind of an elite mod. They take a lot of time to do. They're all hand built. There's nothing CNC done on this particular one. No. It's all hand cut. It's all hand drilled. It's all hand milled. It's all, you know, it's done on a milling machine, obviously, but it's all done by hand. So the fit and finish is, is, is pretty close to perfect. And uh, we're quite proud of that mod. That, that's a nice Great. mod. So for the, uh, the B2650 guys, now you have a saw saddle available. So we don't know how long we're going to produce them. Uh, probably not a long time because, again, we're not going to have them made and in stock. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be a short run of them. So get them while you can because when we, uh, when we sell out of what's on the... Uh, the table there, that's going to be pretty well it. That's right. It takes yeah. time to get material back in stock too. Yes, yeah, and, and we buy we buy that plastic from a uh, supplier in the States and it's uh, it's hard getting it back and forth, you know. Yeah, don't forget to check out our site for other mods for your tractor. The BX's have, uh, we have mods on there for them as well. And we have uh, a lot for the B series. And hopefully after Christmas we'll be getting into the L-Series tractors. So uh, if you have any questions or you want to order something, look at it on the site. If you decide you like something, you can give Kathy, uh, send Kathy an email. The link is always there on the site and on the particular item. And she'll be right back to you. I've seen you answer emails 4 o'clock in the morning. So there it is in the Can't Be No Tizzer. So folks, we hope you enjoy it. And uh, thanks for watching, and thanks for your support, and we'll uh, see you in the next video. Take care, and God bless. Mm -hmm.